brethren, potential candidates, and anybody that's just interested in Freemasonry in general. Today we're going to talk about who the Tyler is, what he does, and why he's in a Masonic Blue Lodge right after this. Welcome to the Freemasonry Squared Mate Sonic YouTube channel. This is Tom Collins. I'm the founder of Freemasonry Squared, and today we're going to talk about who the Tyler is in a Blue Lodge. Uh, he is actually really important, if not one of the most important officers in the Lodge, and let me explain. He's the guy that if you've ever seen on any of the Masonic pictures that you see online, the guy with the really big sword. <laughs> No, not that guy. More like this one. The Masonic Tyler standing outside of a lodge room. And what he's doing out there is guarding the door for anybody that might try to sneak a peek or hear any Masonic lodge business that's going on in the facility. A couple of different ways to spell Tyler if you're looking up additional information on this. One is T-I-L-E-R. The other is T-Y-L-E-R. And there's a a couple of different reasons why which never been necessarily agreed upon depending on who you're reading and where you're getting your information from and let me explain um, from what I understand back in the days there used to be a lot of lodges in taverns and uh, inns uh, from what I understand the old English version of uh, Tyler meant the keeper of an inn and thus that's where they said it may have came from if you're looking at Albert Mackey's uh, encyclopedia of Freemasonry, it states that uh, the tiles that you lay on a roof, the, uh, it was symbolic, being that after a divine edifice was created by the builders or Freemasons or operative Masons, it was covered by the tiles to cover the, the, uh, the sacred essence that was within. And thus, the tiler is symbolically outside of a Masonic Blue Lodge, closing the door, sealing all the sacred precepts and uh, information and business within the confines of the lodge itself. The duties of a tiler in the lodge are going to vary depending on what lodge you're in. Every lodge has their own flavor of masonry and like to do things their own way. From what I understand, uh, there's a couple of different duties for the tiler himself. During the Masonic Lodge, he's going to obviously be guarding the door and making sure nobody comes in unless he's been properly uh, vouched for and that he's wearing his Masonic regalia properly before he enters the lodge out of respect. In addition to that, he's also uh, been in charge of setting up the lodge to make sure that everything's set for the brethren to start. Now, that particular duty is going to definitely vary from lodge to lodge because depending on what lodge you're in, it's really up to them to decide what, what fractions or uh, that they're going to start splitting off duties or, or facets that they're going to start uh, giving certain brothers as far as responsibility is concerned so that's something that you're gonna that you're gonna run into when when going from lodge to lodge but the du the duty of the Tyler is definitely important just important as any other officer in the lodge you want to make sure that uh, if you do decide to ever become a Tyler or if that's something that's ever presented to you as far as the honor of sitting in that chair that you want to just uh, research the information because every single chair in the lodge has a lesson to learn and unless you're out there looking for it you're not going to find it freemasonry is not just going to hand you things you may be able to go through the motions but again until you actually go out there research the information and put it into practice it's just words on paper so uh, to all my brethren that are practicing uh, stay level may we ever meet part and act and i hope you guys enjoy the video if you haven't been here before, feel free to look through our Freemasonry Squared Masonic YouTube channel. And if, again, it's your first time, subscribe. Have a good day. Freemasonry Squared is dedicated to bringing verified information to all those who wish to discover the truth about Freemasonry. If you want the truth, please subscribe and thank you for watching.